Anzoku Teatro America. So there was something like um, they banned Swahili, they banned teaching in Swahili in their schools. So I mean, I content like Sasa Shwali. Wa Tanzania kama utafunza, utalewa nini? Ju, Kingreza ya Diamond. Kama hivo ndiyo standard, utalewa gitu. We, Tanzania zi wameja paka sai. We, bili ni wapole, lakini wako na violence. We, wanaguja kwa ma comments. Hey, umekasirika. Pale social media ulijua how do we? Eni masema tu, Kenya ni vibe. Tuko tu original, tuko unique. What do you want to say? I always get comments from like, I'm not going to be normal. I'm going to be in Kenya. But when you are in Kenya, you're going to be normal. It's not even true. It's not true. It's Kenya vibe. It's not true. It's not true. The gospel industry. Um, did they come through for you? Hey! Um, I need to wish, need to say yes. Um, but to be honest, I think, um, which isn't right, but I think sana sana what was secular, while it okay, like, um, okay, nikisema secular, I mean like pengine non-Christians, um, while it okay, sana sana what was gym, um, unajua na penda fitness, what was gym, while it, while it okay, um, pengine secular, what was secular, like, I think like, I think even like Ogobina was like the first person to message and ask about like, are you okay, what, nini nini? Um, which is a shame because, like, since we're Christians, we're not far from But I think, I think what we're going to go for. I think we're Christians. We're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be able to see that we're not going to be I think as the gospel fraternity at large um tuko na kazi hapo. Yeah. Mtu akikuwa chini tutoke. Yeah. Si kulinga mama wao yamo kunyamaza. Yeah. Eh. But since most of them hawa kutokea from what I'm getting from your answers because you're not really literally telling me that your gospel friends never came through for you. Uh what did you learn about friendship? Hello and welcome. My name is Kalundu Musimi. Na kama kawaida when you see me, it's an exclusive interview about to go down. And seated next to me is one of my favorite content creators. Please give it up for Mzungu Mwitu, Mlami Mwitu, the Reverend Dad, and what's another aka? Wanyonyi. Umesawa Wanyonyi. Wanyonyi, Mzungu Mluya, all those. Hey, kuna mingi. Ati umesema one of your favorite. Is your favorite? Uh, okay, my favorite Yindu. content creator. That's the exclusive. <laughs> you your headline, Sasa. How are you doing? Ah, niko fiti, manze. Niko fiti. Manze, mzae, every time I see you, una represent your looking good, everything. Woo! Leo umetuamia, umetuamulia, it's black and white. Eh, hey, unajua shida, umezoe wazungu wamechapwa, wameparara. <laughs> Sika mimi mengara. <laughs> Ni vile tu hawa ngine. Yeah. Nishiteki um ya mimi mingine ya wazungu wazungu in Kenya venye wanakuanga wameva ushiteki Sijui kama nimeja lakini wanakaa vibaya For real So kuna uniform yao t-shirt yenye ni kidogo yeah. inafika kama hapa ifike hapa mm -hmm. alafu shorts lazima ifike ipite knees mm -hmm. alafu trainers na hizi trainers lazima iko chafu yeah. at least uko na shimo moja kwa to ama uko nyuma sijui wanafikiriaje <laughs> Sijui. Exactly what the meme was actually talking about. Mzungu, we too. Yesterday, by the way, uh, kulikuwa na drip fest. No, only represent. How did it go? Ilikuwa normal. Ilikuwa, ilikuwa so much fun. Mwanojo, mina penda mambo ya fashion. So, sasa kama hii ni kama tuni event yangu. Like, it's just like, in excuse ya kuflex. Unajua kuna zingine, ayo lazimu, unataka kuringa, lakini lazimu chesi chini. Ayo hiyo, inakupea tu full permission when they all out. Now, of course, mimi, personal ninge, ulizo nigesema, you just start your own collection, kwa sababu unarepresenting you when it comes to what you're wearing as well. Sijui, any inspiration, pia, something utamua, oh, 2023, nataka kuanzisha my own. Ayo, ingeweza, 
like uh, most of the clothes that tunaona nikivaa ni mimi nime nime okay mimi sijui kwa shona sina your patience but ni mimi nime design or what um and i think even like kitambo like niko mdogo nilikuwa na nilikuwa na ka t-shirts ni nini nini nilianza ku design i guess to ni time itabidi tu nipate time tuanze hiyo ama utakuwa co 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 founder yeah partner malami malami fashion <laughs> kazi ndio hiyo mlami kalondu fashion yes hey. sitaweza iko sawa sio si wewe kuna capital ya kwanza wewe we ndio uko na hiyo capital like <laughs> but anyway of course umekuwa used to you know the fashion world and especially also in Kenya sio you kama kuna certain celebrities wenye ukiangalia hivyo uko like mm huwa na kuanga ameweza in terms of fashion yeah yeah like me ni mezo fashion tangu niko mdogo like nilikuwa model nili retire from modeling at 19 <laughs> at yeah. 19 aje i think i don't i think when you go to kisema moja i guess ni savara mm-hmm. uh, savara ndio ana anapiga luku yeah. kila saa why uh, wewe na savara same whatsapp eh uh, akikubali uh-huh. tuko same whatsapp group <laughs> uh, and of course uh, apart from you know fashion um last year ulikuwa cuz th- this is the first time nakuona in a long time by the way ulikuwa ulikomenda maju ulikomenda home kukoaje home so unajua waluya lazima waende watch christmas <laughs> so unajua watch kwangu ni uko uk yes um hap, unajua kwangu hapa ni maju mm-hmm. so unajua nyinyi muna eh uko maju si niko maju sasa mm-hmm. alafu nimeenda watch yeah. eh life has no balance but ni sawa uh, so lazima niende huko na niende unajua mimi ni mama's boy so mm-hmm. lazima niende ni, ni shows okay my mama and it was shows mm-hmm. Um so nione shows ni ni none none kiasi eh hey, lakini baridi je wewe you baridi siweza yeah. ah. lakini binadamu mnataka nini kanairo ka kuna jua everybody yako like jua umeenda kuna baridi uko like baridi but mbona unaita mama yako shosh um i think watoto wangu walikuwa the first grand kids so na unajua i see you like like okay mashosho za nowadays you know like quite, i i think ni wazungu too like how like ukimwai waita like grandma yeah. like wana skia so old yeah. like it's like wana feel kama wana zeka sana so they always hey ukienda huko hey utapata majina majabu ya mashosh sijui ni ni lavi sijui ni hagi sijui ni what so i think do like her first grandkids were like half kenyan wale sema tu ilikuwa shosh and and about so even her even her white grandkids yeah. wana muita shosh wow uh, like because they were the first so kila mtu anafuata to line yeah uh, and of course ukienda huko ocha kwa cheki unaenda ngapi na your kids as well yeah lazima hey say the trouble below at all yeah hey our and your traveling our and your security yeah uh, wanapenda uk unajua shida ya uk shosh ana wambe meleza sana unajua mm-hmm. huko like kupata hizi vitu wenye wanapenda ni rahisi so wanakuwa eh wanapenda alafu yeah. warudi Kenya waingie line yeah. eh hey, mimi sina pesa kama shosha kuna pesa we <laughs> ku, ku eh kubembelezi wana shosha mm-hmm. eh hey, mimi ndio eh hizi vitu za kawaida tu so uko anakuwa spoiled and everything but unashi you live with them here how is how has it been uh, you know how has father would been iko sawa mi like i think like to be honest mimi nimekuwa baba tangu niko like at my toy like by the, like my first job yeah. nikiwa like 15 i was looking after kids like that was my job um and then like i've always worked with kids yeah. so i've always been like responsible i think it's different common is ako biologically amo nation how full time because watoto wa watu wengine yani unawalea but then inafika saa unawaradusha unawarudisha sasa kama ni wako hey inafika usiku umechoka lakini bado wako hawaendi yeah. mahali eh uh, but wako sawa wako sawa yeah. 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 and of course pia because you are into content creation as well pale hivyo social media wasi wengine wanasema they get millions in a jipa wasi wengine wako like what tuna struggle wako mzungu mtu iko aje i see that too i think i think uh, like social media ina part to ina part to what to stress sana yeah. like kuna hao wenye pengine wanasema wamesota na wako a bit fine kuna like hao wenye wanasema tu wanapata mamilioni kwa kila siku <laughs> <laughs> well so as always because 
I think wana danganya tu. Like it's fine like if that's kama kama hivi ndo wanataka kufanya fine but me I prefer kwa too honest. Kama times ni rough, iko rough. Kama times ni mzuri, iko mzuri. Um peer life ina kwanga na ups and downs, ndio. For you is it pain? Unafanya kare wewe. But si mbaya, si mbaya. Yeah. Um but I think kwa concentration mm-hmm. like it's not about biz. Okay, biz is a core, but I think uki focus so much on biz it akwa ribu. Like content yangu ni comedy. So, I'm there. You know people watch me to laugh. They don't watch me to advertise. Yeah. I don't know Pampas ama CG. What one advertise nini ngine? Mambo mob. Eh ama chamba ama mabati. You know what one one watch iko funny. Yeah. Una get. So, um kama unaweza check na pia una unaona kitu unataka kununua mm-hmm. bas but mimi my main focus ni kuchekesha watu uh, and of course um you would also want to work it's a new year to work with other content creators you who you're looking forward to m collaborate mfanye mambo mchekeshe wase yeah mimi mimi niko to open hata wewe hata wewe ni content creator <laughs> lakini kuchekesha nayo muwezi cheka hiyo nayo mtangoja tutacheka tutacheka um i guess i also i think the the main guy give props to niflako i think um kitu yenyewe anafanya in the original ni ni one of i think like at a tangu i anze like i've always laughed at his at his comedy so i think yake ni i think yake ni poa eh eh tutaona mzungu mwitu aki cross dress anytime soon in terms of kutaka kuchekesha watu in terms of cross dressing <laughs> yani kelo comedian lazima vai dress nowadays <laughs> <laughs> well <laughs> ah, outaona pengine mm-hmm. <laughs> utaona kwa kwa ukiota ama nini lakini kwa real life ah ah luko ni luko lakini outaona hiyo wache kai okay So so but uh, also what unataka influence yako in terms of social media influencing and everything ifikie wapi wewe unataka like ifike level gani I think uh, me na Samanga sky is the limit you know like uki okay ni mzuri ku dream lakini tena uki dream like I think you'll only achieve that dream yeah. I think your your potential is even bigger than your dreams um I think I don't know like yes there's the big picture but pm you know another small picture i think for me in anglia my individuals like my m or what in anibamba sana now are just individual messages who keep from someone like oh yeah like um like sana sana ina kwanga like you know nimekuwa so down nimekuwa so depressed lakini vile nimeona video zako like nona wacha tu nineza ni kuna nguvu ya leo ama kuna watu wengine like um sija kanyaga kanisa for like five years lakini nimeona kama wewe unaweza kuwa mkristo mimi ninaweza rudi kanisa pia ama like hao wengine is like hey me like sipendi wazungu wa minibo wa koresi ni nini alafu nimeona wewe i'm like ai kumbe watu wanaweza kuwa tofauti so i think ni easy easy individuals mimi naona na hao individuals wote wana make the bigger picture yeah. uh, because we mentioned you know making a difference in different people's lives kuachekesha whatever it is they are going through and their faces in life right yeah. but also last year tuliona there is a time ulienda under the low key sana the low key of the lowest key because ulienda chini ya maji kabisa what was really going on hey, the lowest key hata key haikukua key ilipotea um you know like i think like it's like kind of what we were talking about kwa maisha mimi na kwanga real na saa zingine am too real kama kuna kitu utajua tu mimi sijui kuficha um so like mimi nimekuwa na struggle na okay ni ni depression but ni high functioning depression sasa hii inachanganya watu because like watu wa kisikia depression wanazoea mtu mwenye yani ako chini anakatu miserable yani hakuna kazi anafanya whatever but high functioning depression is like uko depressed but because you're depressed you do so much like as in you do more than a normal person um but i think the problem with that is sasingini ukifanya too much unajua like mwili na kwama tu you know like your mind is part of your body na unafika tu mahali mwili na kwama and that's just what happened like um stress ili zidi maisha ili zidi a point like yani i don't think i got out eh like i lost see you i lost like siku kula wiki moja yeah. siku toka kwa room 
I think I cut like seven kgs in like seven days. Ile kwa kubad. Um like una like ai unamka ujua hata kama utafika John. Um na ni common like I think sana sana kwa comedians. Okay, angle to like our celebrities when you gani sasa zingine wana commit suicide nini nini like ni comedians too because i think okay uko na hiyo level moja ya furaha ni nini kucheka yesa alafu uko na hii side nyingine yenye iko opposite kabisa yeah. and i think yeah like it was just bad like i think that's okay ni mstrago na hizi kala points but i think that's the lowest i've been since like maybe 2009 ni leka viba eh ni leka hao wazungu ni leka wazungu wenye mambo ame parada hata siku shave uso for like karibu 2 weeks eh ana watu wali notice so that i think ndio maana nilisema kwa social media because i did not posted anything for like a week and i think watu wamezoea so i think like you know you guys in your work were like ah you are meenda wapi kuna nini so i was i always believe in honesty and transparency is the best key because what we saw on social media is uh you you saying you haven't eaten you couldn't even stand yani you've been depressed and um if you don't mind taking us through what really happened to you yeah like um in common mesema like it's just like i run an organization for example you know like nini mumeza tu nikiwa social media unajua na na kwanga serious yeah na kwanga na job um from 9 to 5 so i've run an ngo for like um since i was like around 20 so now i'm 32 so it's a lot of pressure um to na deal na boy child um so okay at the moment we have like 47 boys but at the most i've had like 85 alaf pia uko na sana sana ni mama yao so you know that's a lot of pressure like watu wana kuangalia who sort problems out na sasa zingine hauna easy ideas yeah. or answers zote um, and i think i got to a point i was working too much i wasn't listening you know like your mind is the same as your body you know like ukianza tu kusikia ka uchungu kwa mguu alafu endelea kutembea itazidi yeah. so i think that's the point i didn't listen to my body um, and i think the pressure even social media pressure it's a lot Um, ni ni fun ni positive si hata but yeah. you know like ukifikiria like i think now my insights insights so like that's like people that are seeing your content not necessarily your followers but people that are interacting with my content it's like 5 million a month sasa i don't what's the population of kenya like 45 million or something that means yeah but that means like one in nine kenyans wanaona sura yangu every month eh fikri hivyo ina watu wengi so i think it's just you know sasa yeah. zingine una unafika tu mahali kuna kwama and i something that is important to because i nimesikia mara mingi watu wanasema anga depression is a white man's disease but statistically black women are the people group that struggle with mental health the most so i think you know we just have to be more honest about it so many normal people so many celebrities so many politicians sisi wote ni tuna struggle na mam lazima tufungue ro tuendelea yeah so mzungu mwitu thank you so much for clearing that for the very first time because i know even when i was going through the comment section kuna watu watu i don't know whether they know you or they don't know you so these these to shut down claims that these could have been caused by relationships or anything uh touching in love something to do with love i think you know it's just part of the industry people will always look for something that's not there you know like simu wakoe na yani katamu kasukari kachumvi na sasa zingine ni maisha tu sasa zingine unachapa tu yeah so unataka ni same so no si mambo ya kipenzi eh ni life tu yeah life si kipenzi peke yeah and you being a psychological counselor as well ume watu wamezoea kukuja kwako for counseling then kwako ilikuwaaje who did you go for for advice kwake ulienda kwa nani um okay like yeah like i'm okay that's my training na people they wanna shtuka hiyo they like yani wewe unachekesha watu sasa ukikuja counseling utaongea nini ama utacheka but that's now like that's like a different side of me 
Um, but yeah, like it's it's hard. Like I think, and I think whenever you're down, whether it's you know whether like for me it was depression. For somebody else it might be you know what well, maybe they're broke or they're you know they've been fired or something. I think sana sana, you know the people that you might think would help. Hawako alafu unashtuka tu like sasa mtu mwenye hata uwezi fikiria wewe inaweza kusaidia wanatokea um but yeah like counselors wako hata counselors lazima waende counseling um you know like doctors still get sick counselors still get depressed and sick yeah it's no but it's sick yeah it's it's sick um so yeah like iko tu what work Uh, and i know you have a lot of uh friends from the gospel industry um do they come through for you hey um i nineza wish nineza sema yes um but to be honest i think um which isn't right but i think sana sana watu wa secular wale tokea like um, okay nikisema secular i mean like pengine non christians um wale tokea sana sana watu wa gym um unajua napenda fitness so watu wa gym wale wale tokea um pengine secular watu wa secular like i think like i think even like ogobina was like the first person to message and ask about like are you okay what nini nini um which is a shame because like sisi wa kristo tunafaa kukua eh uh, uh, but i think i think watu wanago part yeah i think uh, wa kristo wamezoea mtu akikuwa na shida unasema tu nitakuombea sasa kama mtu aku depressed hapo unasema i say you know like item side yes i think because hawajui kufanya nini hawafanyi kitu um but nina wapenda they're still my friends um sina beef na, na gospel musicians but i think as the gospel fraternity at large um tuko na kazi hapo mtu akikuwa chini tutoke si kulinga mama yao yamo kunyamaza Uh, but since most of them hawa kutokea from what i'm getting from your answers because you're not really literally telling me that your gospel friends never came through for you uh what did you learn about friendship uh friendship okay what i can say number one is mimi sina marafiki wengi like i literally probably have like two best friends and then like everybody else okay so so what a jam <laughs> but i you know like i don't have that like yani in a circle ni very tight very small um but friendship i think you can you'll always be surprised mm-hmm. at who comes out for you yeah. and friendship is not something that's public yeah. friendship is something that's private mm-hmm. um you know and somebody might come for you in private mm-hmm. and then in public at a what at they don't even know that you're friends yeah. and i think that's friendship friendship is a deeper connection than just to comment on you know pictures nini nini um it's about support love unconditional yeah hivo yeah. yeah then from all that experience how do you now protect your peace in going forward yeah um me me si bother na watu kusema ukweli mimi naishi line like line yangu i think ku, ku mimi ku ku frustrate mimi mm-hmm. inakwanga ngumu sana yeah. um I, yeah like I I I don't bother with people kila mtu anaishi maisha yake like yeah. kama nimesema like you know if my friends are you know what were gospel na awaku awaku tokea mi sina shida yeah so maisha imesonga mbele mimi niko sawa um at how wako sawa mm-hmm. tuendelee kuchapa njili mm-hmm. um lakini next time <laughs> eh tokea <laughs> Asiwa toke sintio. Um mzungu mwitu what is that one misconception about you? Uh, I don't I think so I don't I think a lot of people are scared. Yeah. I don't know why I see, I think it must just be rangi because yeah. miss yoni kitu kingine yenye inaweza fanya watu waogope. Yeah. Like that okay I get a, I got stopped a lot yeah. a lot of pictures nini nini but the amount of DMs I get. Yeah. Nilikuona mahali niliogopa it's like sasa unagopa nini yeah. like literally I'm the most chilled out person um so i guess that's a misconception yeah. na misconception eh hey, that was ungu wako na pesa we <laughs> yani umeona vile wamparara na wamechapo na bado unafikiria wako na pesa eh hey, what so i think that's just a misconception in general yeah 
hey, uko uko inje ni kubad za hizi. Zungu, do you get any women wanting to date you for the money that you're saying you do not have? Okay. Okay. Like sweezi danganya like kuna attention mingi. I don't really pay attention to it. I don't think it's, you know, like I'm not interested. Yeah. So I just ignore it. So yeah. I don't know what their intentions are. Yeah. Um but I don't know. I think maybe I should start a dating service. Yeah. For other people. Not for you. Ah. Uh, me I'm fine. Me I'm fine. I want to start a dating service for other people. Yeah. You can be our first client. Who? You. We look for you a nice um cameraman. No, no, you're literally telling us you're you're taken. So can I roll women to kai to ki Can you need okay me say on game a personal sana but in a zemotu what what do I kai? Yeah. Uh but she just give details but uh I think me me na focus kwa life, kwa ministry, um kwa toy, na niko sawa. So uh what do I kai to? Well wakuachane na how na do your do kuna concept sijui hata hata sijaongea na manager juu ya hiyo but the amount of dms that i get yeah. from women that wamepata watoi mm-hmm. na wazungu alafu wazungu wamehepa we mimi sijui hao hao wazungu wanaendaga wapi yeah. but i don't know what we can do i think to i'm to answer series sasa sasa sijui tafuta ma mababas wame wenye wame wame lakini like yani pengine ni wazungu wamekoa hapa yeah. wamepea mtu mimba alafu wameenda wa watumi kitu wasaidi wana sijui tutafanya aje but hiyo ni concept hii ni show mpya tuanze co-host Cynthia. and i think you know like okay sana sana you know i'm from the uk yeah. pengine hawa ni uk germany us italy whatever cultures ni different yeah. i don't know why because mimi i don't think i could ever like see the atom toy but i think when attack to kwa leo like kwani kwa culture yako ni normal kupea mtu mimba alafu ku disappear ama ni nini yeah um so i think ni help not like financial or anything but i think ni i think when attack to understand yeah she dey kwa api na mi hata si juu she dey kwa api lakini kwa show yetu tutaenda kutafuta hawa tuulize she dey kwa api hiyo ni content ya show yetu yes tumeandika tuandika proposal Uh, but also life yako kwa on the low key manze uh, we speak uh, you speak about you know your kids but very rarely do you even speak about their mom uh you know i think um obviously kids have a mom mm-hmm. they can't um you know kids don't just come from anywhere unless it's Jesus mm-hmm. um but i would say kids you know when they're big mm-hmm. i think i won't even talk about them yeah You know nobody sees them. I don't put them on social yeah. media. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but I won't talk about them because they can talk about themselves. Yeah. You know I think when somebody is an adult um you know see a proper and fair kongea on someone's behalf. Yeah. If if they have something to say they can say it themselves. Yeah. Uh, Even the mother. Yeah. So I can I, I, she's she can talk. Yeah. Okay. Well, oh, tam tafuta. Ah what kwa nini? Ah unaweza mtafuta. Ni sawa. Is there something you'd change about yourself? In what way? Just any way. I, you know, I think most people would expect me to say I would want to be Kenyan. But I think also I think the the reason that I am who I am is because I'm not Kenyan but I'm Kenyan. Mm-hmm. I think you can't change things about yourself. Uno joy ki change kitu moja ukifikiri it make better and as affect my yako yote iko e was. I think kill of kitu mistakes like mountains valleys and let hey neza na wish ni neza unga bila kwenda gym free six packs yes 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 free six packs eh yes yo 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 una just quizzes zinanunuliwa at wapi ah hizi vitu tumeziona kwa china zinabaiwa bana waachana na vitu ya china So so you would really want to get six packs without going to the gym without actually doing the work. You know like 10 mm-hmm. you like it's like what I said ningependa lakini then uki then you won't be fit. Yeah. You know tutakuwa na mwili poa lakini kupanda stairs 
utaanza kupumua vibaya so i guess ni tena hakuna no pain no gain yeah. hata leo nimetoka gym yeah. nimekaa kwa kiti sijui kama nita nitamka tena mimi nimefanya mguu mm. eh nimefanya mguu kwa ruaka ruaka eh so asha tuambie anaishi ruaka by the way unaishi ruaka mzungu mwitu that's where you stay <laughs> nimesema gym iko huko kwanza ah. ni ah ya ukweli ah, kuna bestia kuna gym huko uh-huh. but nilipanda nduthi ya 30 minutes nilipika huko nilikosa bolt yeah. eh. unapanda nduthi ah, lazima saa zingine lazima ufike haraka uh-huh. unafanya tu mapanya route ni nini nini unafika haraka yeah. eh ni lazima what is that one fun thing about being in kenya i think kenya is just a vibe uh-huh. like kenya I, like there's no people like kenyans like even ugandans and tanzanians they don't understand us uh-huh. Like Kenya is just a vibe. Ni lefanya content ngine juzi tu. Because at 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 ni fault ya mpajo. Eh anza 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 kwa So there was something like um they banned Swahili. They banned teaching in Swahili in their schools. Yes. Sasa mimi nafanya content like sasa shwali. Mm-hmm. Wa Tanzania kama utafunza <laughs> utalewa nini mm-hmm. juu Kiingereza ya diamond. Yeah. Kama hivyo ndio standard auta elewa kitu we Tanzania zimo meja paka sai we bili ni wapole lakini wako na violence yeah. we wanakuja kwa ma comments hey umekasirika pale social media ulijua how do we ni msema tu mm-hmm. Kenya ni vibe yeah. tuko tu original tuko unique watu wanasema i always get comments kwa kisema like hakuna mtu normal mm-hmm. amebaki Kenya mm-hmm. paka wenye au wenye wamekuja kama wewe yeah. au uko normal <laughs> Sisi tu sisi tu ni Kenya ni vibe yeah. uh, kila kitu ni fun kabisa uh, and there's this time by the way ulikuwa una appeal for help yeah, yeah. what was it about so um to kuna kama you enjoy that i'm talking about um kama nimeza okay ni jokes but kweli like pesa yetu yote ya kulisha au vijana kwa tuma uh, shule ni nini ni inatoka maju sasa maju vile put na ameamua anza ku invade prices in skyrocket kutafuta pesa huko ni kubad um so tukana um pay bill um that tulianza at least pia wa Kenya unajua ni ni Kenyans that tunawajenga so ni pa pia Kenyans waki wakisaidia um so likwa tu tunafanya appeal that um Kenyans can help us get the kids back in school pia niko yeah. LD eh ni pale LD eh eh unaweza tuambia pay bill manze msee mwenye anataka ku reach out ku help anaweza do hivyo as well eh uh, so um pay bill let me spend the numbers mm-hmm. i hope ni dasa nikisema you right kama ni ndasema wrong na mtu apate pesa yangu ni shida <laughs> but uh, 793282 ndio pay bill um account number wanaweza wake to their name or anything um na pia leo nita nitaweka iyo pay bill kwa story zangu so pia in case ujashika pay bill ama nimesema wrong naweza angalia kwa stories pia you check eh, eh. of course manze help another kenya hapo hivyo what does 2023 look like for mzungu mwitu hey i at a miss you at vile 22 mimi mimi nipeleka mbio wewe at a you 2023 na kaaje um but i think it's good yeah. Um this year he travel sana last year eh last year ni travel mingi mm-hmm. um this year na kapoa mm-hmm. i think ni kuendelea tu na maisha bila iko mm-hmm. um i think i want to explore kenya more mm-hmm. i think ni the same hivyo yeah like nairobi najua ld najua mm-hmm. western <laughs> sinajua mm-hmm. um but is i you know I, i need to walk around kenya i need to find out you know anata costo like staki tu kwenda kwa resort na dako kutembea yeah. i think that's what ni nasa sema lazima nitembea nataka kufika kila kila kona ya kenya yeah. nini iko kwa bucket list yako in terms of traveling in kenya in kenya um i think i don't i've only ever been to masai mara ningependa kwenda hizi zingine mm-hmm. nataka kwenda lamu mm-hmm. niliona post zingine hey lamu ina kafiti lamu ni tamu eh hey, umeenda lamu ni tamu acha nikwambie <laughs> Umerai, umerai. Eh, yeah, but I think yeah, nataka kwenda Lamu, I think. Yeah. Inakatu imeitulia kidogo. Eh, yeah. uh, hiyo ndio bucket list ya not ya this year, ya the next three months lazima ni kike Lamu. Okay. Uh, And I wish you all the best kwenda Lamu, manze ku explore, kujibamba, ku enjoy. Yeah, yeah.
na ku stay healthy yes uh, well mzungu mwitu thank you so much for always coming through we really do appreciate you yeah no na ku appreciate sana unajua wewe mm-hmm. ndio maana umepata ne, unajua kuongea mambo ya mental health na watu yeah. sijaongea na mtu mwingine ni wewe tu na hii ndio maana wewe ni wewe ni mnoma Asante sana. I really do appreciate. Well, that was the one and only Mzungu Mwitu aka the Reverend Dad aka Mzai. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Kalondo Musimi. Behind the camera is David Silabwa and Saidi Abdallah. Bye. Bye. <laughs>